Opening on April 13th, Expo 2025 Osaka, Kansai, Japan is bringing together over 150 countries to imagine a more sustainable way to live. Dubbed the Expo of the Sea, Sky and Land, this global event is a showcase of incredible Japanese inventions and international innovations, tackling real-world challenges with cutting-edge technology. In this video, we'll dive into some of the most exciting breakthroughs you can expect to see in Osaka from now until October 13th. Our journey begins on water with Japan's first commercial hydrogen-powered boat developed by the Iwatani Corporation. This revolutionary vessel can transport 150 passengers while emitting zero carbon dioxide. Unlike traditional gas-powered boats, it produces minimal noise, odor, and vibration, offering a glimpse into the future of maritime transportation. Expo visitors will experience this eco-friendly technology firsthand, as these ferries will shuttle them to and from the exhibition grounds. It's not just transportation, it's a statement about preserving our oceans and marine biodiversity while harnessing the power of water. Speaking of water power, meet the Wave Duck, an innovative offshore power station developed by Yellow Duck Inc., a small Kobe-based startup led by CEO Shigo Nakayama. The Wave Duck technology is envisioned as a novel type of offshore power station that harnesses the power of ocean waves. CEO Shigo Nakayama and a small team of three people is diligently working to bring this concept to fruition. The primary function of the Wave Duck is dual. It aims to produce energy from ocean waves and simultaneously capture carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. This dual capability positions it as a technology geared towards achieving carbon neutrality and providing a local solution for renewable energy. The technology has already received awards for its potential. One of the most distinctive features of their prototype is the use of an inflatable yellow duck. This adorable packaging serves a practical purpose beyond aesthetics. The inflatable duck helps the prototype stay afloat on the water's surface. Additionally, its bright yellow color and size make the device visible to oncoming ships, enhancing maritime safety. As the wave duck bobs on the water, it is actively engaged in its energy generation and carbon capture processes. The mechanism behind the wave energy capture and carbon dioxide absorption is deceptively simple. The device captures carbon dioxide from the atmosphere while simultaneously producing energy from the waves. By the way, if you're finding this video helpful, then feel free to subscribe. It really helps me out with the algorithm. OK, back to the video. Now, let's dive into the microscopic world of microalgae. At the CHOS Group's Kagawa Research Center, scientists are exploring how these tiny, plant-like organisms could solve some of humanity's biggest challenges, from food shortages to fossil fuel dependence. What makes microalgae remarkable is their extraordinary efficiency. Through photosynthesis, they produce vast quantities of biomass, organic materials including sugars, oils and proteins, while absorbing carbon dioxide. Unlike traditional crops, they require no soil and significantly less water, making them perhaps the most efficient farming method on the planet. iChoice has already established the world's largest microalgae production facility, a 5-hectare plant in Malaysia, and aims to expand tremendously by 2050. They're working with over 100 Japanese companies to develop diverse applications, from bioplastics and cosmetics to paints and glues. Visitors to the Japan Pavilion will be greeted by an unexpected sight. Hello Kitty characters dressed as different types of algae. A playful introduction to the diverse world of these aquatic plants and their potential to reshape our future. Speaking of reshaping our future through innovative sustainability solutions, imagine if your windows could power your home. That's the vision driving Optimus, an Osaka startup developing transparent solar cells that capture infrared light which comprises nearly half of the sun's energy output and remains untapped by conventional solar panels. These revolutionary panels look just like regular glass but contain nearly colorless nanoparticles that absorb infrared light and convert it into electricity. As a bonus, they provide natural heat shielding, potentially reducing room temperatures by around 3 degrees Celsius during summer months. Optimus plans to produce full-size prototypes by 2030 with commercial availability targeted for 2040. Visitors can learn more about this technology at the Electric Power Pavilion, which showcases 30 different energy sources that could power our future. 
While Optimus harnesses the sun's invisible spectrum to generate power, another Japanese innovation is exploring how to eliminate the need for electrical lighting altogether. What if we could light our world without electricity? Japanese startup LEP is making this possible by bioengineering glow-in-the-dark plants. Building on research from Osaka University and Nara Institute of Science and Technology, they introduce bioluminescent genes from mushrooms into plant cells. Most experiments have focused on tobacco plants due to their ease of propagation and modification, but the technology is expanding to species like poplar trees. The bioluminescence works through a chemical reaction that requires no electric power whatsoever. At the healthcare pavilion, LEP presents a traditional Japanese tea room featuring a neon green glowing bonsai tree, a serene yet futuristic space that hints at a world where living plants could illuminate our streets and homes, potentially reducing electricity consumption for lighting on a massive scale. LEP hopes to make this technology commercially available within the next decade. What if you could not only see a hologram but actually touch it? Ceramics company Nera, collaborating with Tokyo University, has created exactly that, an aerial sense device that brings the tactile dimension to virtual objects. Using lead-free ceramics and precisely controlled ultrasonic waves, the device pushes against your skin, creating a sensation that feels remarkably like touching a solid object, whether that's a plushy toy or any other texture. This breakthrough could revolutionize how we connect across distances, allowing people to literally feel each other's presence through digital interfaces. Visitors can experience this mind-bending technology at Nera's area of the Future City Pavilion, where it addresses the exhibition's themes of environment and energy, by showing how even our most advanced interfaces can become more sustainable. Perhaps the most profound innovations at Expo 2025 are those saving human lives. Startup Curabio Inc. is showcasing a miniature heart just three centimeters across, composed of over 100 million iPS cells or induced pluripotent stem cells taken from adults. While this tiny heart is for demonstration, Curabio's real breakthrough lies in their thin sheets of iPS myocardial tissue, which serve as patches for damaged hearts. Eight patients have already been treated with this regenerative medicine with remarkable results. All have shown improved conditions and returned to their normal lives. This technology is so promising that Dr. Sawa, an expert in the field, was selected to executive produce the Persona Group's pavilion at the Expo. Themed Thank You Life, this exhibition includes interactive displays on the future of sleep and medicine featuring the beloved character Astro Boy as a guide to tomorrow's healthcare innovations. From life-saving to life-enhancing, our final stop is the human washing machine of the future, a reimagining of the ultrasonic bath from the 1970 Osaka Expo. Developed by Osaka-based shower head manufacturer Science Company, this advanced bathing system uses microbubble technology to cleanse without soap. Some of these bubbles are incredibly small, efficiently removing dirt and grime while conserving water. But this isn't just about getting clean. It's about total wellness. Sensors in the backrest scan the user's heart health and stress levels in real time using artificial intelligence developed in collaboration with Osaka University researchers the system then plays personalized music or video clips designed to relax or energize the bather based on their physiological data. Unlike its 1970 predecessor, which never saw widespread adoption, science company chairman Yasuaki Aoyama hopes this technology will find practical applications beyond the expo. 1,000 lucky visitors will have the opportunity to experience this wellness innovation at the healthcare pavilion alongside technologies from over 400 small and medium enterprises from the Kansai region. From hydrogen-powered boats to glowing plants, touchable holograms to life-saving heart patches, Expo 2025 Osaka Kansai offers a window into technologies that are not just futuristic fantasies, but practical solutions nearing implementation. These innovations share a common thread, addressing humanity's most pressing challenges while creating a more sustainable, connected and healthier world. As you explore these pavilions, you're not just witnessing demonstrations, Tao, you're experiencing the future taking shape, a future being crafted right here in Japan to transform how we live on land, sea and in the skies above. Welcome to Expo 2025, where tomorrow begins today.